Oh my god, this this new computer, man. All right. Oh, cool. Grifter already sees me. Welcome back. He says, hello, Grifter. Hello, John Lee. 10 4. Everybody refresh if you don't see Seek. Thank you all for being here. Welcome to the Seek and Destroy stream. And we are back with the second episode of Halo 2 Anniversary Edition. And um, I th in the first episode, we kind of, you know, were on our ship. Master Chief was getting medals. Uh, and then the Covenant have decided to, uh, they located Earth and are attacking big time with big, big waves of enemies uh, and, and just sending pretty much everything they got at us. So now we are, um, we attack them back by throwing one of their own bombs that they planted on our ship. We basically, as Master Chief, chucked it through space by hand and uh, blew up their core main ship. And so now we are coming down to Earth to battle them on the ground and protect Earth. Uh, basically, the, the Covenant are desperate at this point, and they are trying to find answers. And they believe there might be some uh, on Earth here to lead them to where their next destination is going. Because as you know, they have religious leaders like uh, like the, the prophets. And one of them is the prophet of regret. And there's you know, people, uh, they picked up a transmission, regret, regret. And it's the, the prophet coming and basically le trying to lead them to the great journey, which is what they believe they will reach if they just allow the flood to, you know, take over and unify all life forms in the, in the galaxy. So very interesting. Their belief system is definitely crazy on a lot of levels, but uh, it's what they believe, right? So, uh, so you have belief against, you know, like, uh, military. It's, it's pretty crazy. And now we are down on the earth, uh, down on, on the surface of this world fighting them. So let's get right into it. Our plane crashed. They shot us down and it's time to kick some ass. Wow. wow. What? go anywhere all right I think now we just have to defend this area keep hitting the wrong thing to reload so you can see my flashlight clipping on and off that's just uh that's me being stupid let's do this hashtag what's up ugly Suck it. There we go. There we go. Oh. 
Nice. Right now, it's just pretty much just killing. There's not a lot of, uh, not a lot going on here except just kill everything that shows up. Oh, all right. Here we go. He's charging up. Dead son. Are we good? Can we go? Shit. Here we go. You sneaky bastard. Damn. I'm loving the gun designs in these games as well, John. He says, yeah, the gun designs on this are fantastic. Um, I mean, like, they, you know, they, they follow pretty much what was in the first game, but uh, the dual firing is really great. I like that they added that. I really like when you get to play the Arbiter, um, and you actually get, you know, the, the rarer weapons to get are the human weapons. Um, those are always, those My are always fun. a little big for that courtyard, Sergeant. I see a good LZ on the other side of these buildings. Meet you there. Over. All right. Copy that. Here Don't we go. Oh shit. My favorite guns in all the Halo games, though, are definitely the, uh, excuse me, my throat is killing me, um, is the, uh, whatchamacallit, the, the, the Forerunner guns in Halo 4. I really, really dig those. Um, I think they have some cool designs. They look very Cybertronian, so I think I'm a little biased, because I'm like, oh, they look like Transformer weapons. Sergeant, I need you on that bird. My Pelicans are going to start airlifting armor and reinforcements. Need an escort that isn't afraid of the little hospital ground fire. Anything for you, Keys. Keys is bay. Not as bay as Cortana, but pretty bay. Dead. 
There we go. Nice. I'm not normally that great with snipers, but their snipers, like these ones, they're okay. I can I can handle them alright. I like that when you like pull like you pull the trigger like three or four times though, the gun like over overheats. Like that. Sometimes just pulling it twice can do that. Another sniper? There we go. No one is talking. No, what do you say? No one is talking? No one is talking. Did you try to kick a rock at me? Chief, Say what? Glad you could make it. Crash site's on the other side of this hotel, Chief. Covenant are crawling all over it. Follow me. Uh, keeps you from lying on spray and, and prey. <coughs> yeah, exactly. Yep, that's true. Night, night changes up the uh, the gameplay a bit. Sugar water. Um, is I can't remember if that's an inside joke to Men in Black or not. I remember they put a lot of inside jokes in some of these games. But if you remember Men in Black... Um, uh, Vincent D'Onofrio in the first one, when when he the alien crawls into the the redneck farmer guy, um, he's like, I want some sugar water, and then they just like keep pouring scoops of sugar into this glass of water. said Pendejo. Door. You're done. Here we go. Alright, I'm gonna drive because I'm gonna try to get us through this as fast as possible. The highest concentration of Covenant troops is directly below the carrier. I don't think they want you to get on board. No, they don't. That bridge is the most direct route to the <laughs> This full kicking kicking rocks and us at us? Yeah, oh yeah. Kick, the guy was kicking rocks at us, yeah. It looked like he was. He was trying to. Alright, we're gonna try to just blow through this. How do you feel, Mac? Good enough to fuck your mother! Hey, you know what? Some of us... Never took driving lessons, bub. Let's get in the goddamn Jeep. Thank you. This tunnel links up to the bridge. It's full of rats, if you know what I mean. But it beats swimming. Boom. Look at us hauling ass. I've been analyzing the Covenant tactical chatter. They're surprised, confused. Yeah, we we're, we're, we're skipping a lot of stuff, but like I said, <coughs> this isn't exactly a speed run, but we're just trying to expedite some of this. We've already played, you know, through all these games, so if I can make these episodes a little bit shorter, I'm gonna try to do that. But yeah, there are some levels that we can just you know, power through. Ooh. 
we go. Oh my god, some of us never took driving lessons just getting the goddamn Jeep. <laughs> yep. <coughs> Another suburban line from Sea. Get in, guys. Music is nice. Here's the old school graphics. There we go. Checkpoint. <laughs> oh, the music is gore. Yeah, the music's really good. Like I said, I always like that they, they mix kind of like tribal music along with... Uh, Shit, we gotta run. Boom. And we're leaving our guys behind and getting the fuck out. But they always mix like tribal with instrumental and techno and the Halo games, even though they've a lot of them have been orchestrated by different people. They all keep the same kind of vibe, which I really dig. All right. Made it to that level pretty quickly. Oh, my God. I need to drink, drink like a chug of this every like five minutes just to keep my voice going. Ugh. I'm so sorry, everyone. I wish. Like I said, I could have taken another day off today and not streamed, but I was just like, man we've already gone a couple days without it and I just wanted to get through some of these games but you know um, we will extend Halo month so that way we can play through all of them so we'll go into July as well oh shit yes Where's the rest of your platoon? Wasted, Sarge. And we will be too, sir, if we don't get the hell out of here. You hit Marine. N no, sir. Then listen up. You had your chance to be afraid before you joined my beloved corps. <laughs> but to guide you back to the true path, I brought this motivational device. <laughs> Off big green style cannot be defeated. What about that scarab? We've all run the simulations. They're tough, but they ain't invincible. Stay with the Master Chief. You'll know what to do. Yes, sir, Sergeant. Thanks for the tank. He never gets me anything. <laughs> oh, I know what the ladies like. Oh, <laughs> Jesus. <laughs> All right, here we go. They're dead. Dead again. Now, take it to 
I think that's Michelle Rodriguez, right? Did we discuss that in the last playthrough of this? Sounds a lot like her. Yeah, that's totally her. Enemy okay, everyone be cool. Goodbye. Screwing shit up. Yeah, it's Michelle Rodriguez. Kitty Money, what's up? Hey, how's it going? Poor guys. Yeah. <laughs> Poor guys, nothing. They got Master Chief watching their back. Um, what's up, Kitty Money? Good to see you. Sorry you have to hear my voice like this. Look at that guy. Running on the end there. Come on up board. Yeah, there you go. Join us. Old school graphics, new school graphics. Oh shit. Who the fuck is shooting us? You're down. Nice, good shooting. Hey fam, what's up? Eat feet. How's it going? How's everyone doing tonight? Thank you all for being here. Sorry I'm being a little quiet. I'm trying to reserve my my voice as much as I can. But I'm obviously to hang out with y'all, so if you got any questions, got anything to say, let me know. Kitty, good to see you. Been a while. I hope you're doing well. Eat feet, thanks for being here. Everyone else, John Lee, everyone who's been in the chat, Grifter, Grifter. Oh, shoot. Oh. Oh, we hurt Michelle Rodriguez. No, Michelle Rodriguez is bay. We're on fire, holy shit. Are we gonna make it? Just relax and wait until I can start working again. All right. Mess with Texas, yo. Be right back. No problem, kitty. I'll see you in a second. Shit. Barely alive. We're on fire and shit. 
All right, come on, go, go, go. It's funny that the music, like, level dies down when you flip to the old graphics. <laughs> Eat feet bay, I know, right? Eat feet is bay. Um, Eat feet, I got my hot sauce book right here for the hot sauce challenge. I am so not ready for this. My mom was like, well, look at it this way. This will clear up your sinuses. And I'm like, yeah, it might even cure me of my current cold, but it's going to provide me with a shit ton of new problems. Literally a shit ton of new problems. on the other side, sir. Use this. We need stomach lining <laughs> or a working butthole. Yeah, I'll take a working butthole. I'm gonna need one after this is done. I need a butthole transplant. shields. Oh, you're dead. <laughs> How'd that feel, Shakes? Ooh, 100% one, yes. Um, what up, Seek? When did you start streaming? Uh, about an hour ago. What's up, Take Kim? How you doing? Good to, good to see you. Good to see you. Um, thank you, Moobot, for explaining the bit system. Appreciate it. Big shout out to Corndog666, who came in hot uh, the first episode and dropped um, six biddies right away, like right off the bat. dead. You're dead. You're dead. Oh, I see a big motherfucking thing over there. Oh, wait. Is that an actual sniper? Oh, shit. Son. Everybody was kung fu fighting. <clears throat> what the fuck? Dude. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Dude, a thousand biddies from Grifter. Holy shit, dude. Thank you. Oh my god, hold on. I gotta take a swig so I can talk. <laughs> Oh my God, Grifter. Thank you, dude, thank you so much. 
What is that for? Why so many? That's so awesome of you. And you did one of each kind. You did the Craigasm. You did the Rage. You did the Salt. Holy mother of balls. I'm really debating if I want an HP. Uh, oh, you're trying to decide, Kitty, if you want an HP? Grifter, everybody, shout out to Grifter. Holy shit. Um, Grifter, are you on my monthly shout outs? I think you are, but yeah, you are. Okay. Holy shit, dude. A thousand biddies. Thank you, thank you, thank you, Grifter1337. I really, really do appreciate that. With no bit boss, I keep forgetting your channel takes bits. Uh, oh, yeah, I don't have a bit boss. I need to... I need to figure that out. Um, I Right now, I just have the Moobot reminder, which I think happens every, like, 50 lines or something. Um, it's, it's not often. It's a nice looking vehicle you got there. Um... A grifter, dude. Thank you so much. That is just freaking nice of you, dude. I'm not sure, but watching this E3 ad has me made me pondering. Is Bethesda going to release a new game? Possibly. Oh, you know, Bethesda, um, they, they, they had their press conference today, I think. Pretty sure. So uh, I think you can watch their press conference on YouTube of all their announcements. Um, I haven't watched it yet, so um, I don't know. I've only watched the EA one, and I haven't even finished it yet. Um... I forgot that I thought those were starting tomorrow with Xbox, um, but I guess Bethesda started today um, along with EA. So uh, I'm I'm late late to the party, but uh, yeah, I, um, I think they made all their announcements today. Yeah. Um, yeah, I need a new laptop. Mine is falling apart. Literally, any news on The Sims? Um, I do not know. No news for me. Uh, all I saw on EA was mainly just the, the Battlefront thing, and then, like, some sports stuff, and then, like, the opening thing with, with the sports stuff. They had, like, a band out there, like, in the football jerseys, um, like, do their opening ceremony music and stuff. And it was pretty cool. I just, um... I just uh, wasn't really paying attention. Like I said, I w I've been sick all day, so I've been in bed. And uh, it was on, but I wouldn't say I was paying attention to it. Oh, it's one of my teammates. Okay. Oh, shit. Get it. Taking him down by hand. Boom. There we go. Master Chief, you are the man. going here though Sir, Corporal Perez, A Company, CP's this way. Um Lieutenant got hit as soon as we Oh, you should be asleep. It's like midnight. <laughs> That's all right. I've been sleeping all day. Um Come on, I'll show you. So I'm probably going to be up for a while. Um, 
but I appreciate the, <laughs> the concern. When I have to reinforce oh, shit. It, Scarab, you feeling alright sick? You don't sound 100%. No, I'm super sick, dude. Um, I am super duper sick. Oh, shit. <laughs> Marine, did I give you permission to bitch? Oh shit. Um Yeah, no, I've been I've been sick all fucking day. Uh, I've been sick all week actually since Tuesday, the last night we streamed. Um I've been I've been I don't know what it was, but I caught something really bad. Um so yeah, I'm, I'm a little bit sick is sick, yeah. But that's all right because we're here tonight. And we're having fun, and I think after we do this, we're gonna we're gonna stop this episode. I just gotta board this. Uh, I just gotta board this thing. Go down there or what? So after this cutscene, we'll probably end this episode. I'm gonna go get my laundry, and we'll come back and we'll do we'll play another another maybe two episodes. Um, hashtag six seek. Yeah, I'm up for a few more hours at least. Just gotta grab a jacket when you switch episodes. No problem. What's up, Draco? How's it going? Extract the chief and return to an amberclad. Roger that. All right. Status. Sir, the prophet is bugging out. Request permission to engage. Negative, Commander. All Victor two heavies for star side. Here we go. It's a good, good, and an episode end too. It's going to jump inside the city. There's no time, sir. Green light, green light to engage. Go, go, go. So they're done with, they're done with whatever they were doing on Earth, and now they're jumping into hyperspace from orbit right above this city. We are not losing that ship. And Key's like, fuck it. I don't care where they're going. They could lead us right to an army of more ships. We're going after them. The balls on that chick, dude. Boom! Nailed it. Unfortunately, the force of that jump, though. Because that was the other option. And she's like, well, we could stay here and blow up. Or we chase after them. So this is a good place to end because the next episode we'll come back. We'll play as the Arbiter. We'll get to jump over to the the uh, Covenant side and see the Arbiter's journey. So I think we're going to see a cutscene here. We'll watch it and then we'll take a like a five minute break. I'm going to go get my laundry. We'll come right back in like five minutes and we'll play um, play more Halo. So don't go anywhere. Look at how tiny the UNSC ship is compared to the Covenant mothership. I know. I know, right? Like We're totally the underdog in this battle. Even with like Master Chief and stuff. Um, how much further must we heft this baggage? Any cell will do. Why not toss it in with this lot? They could use the meat. Them? <coughs> what about us? My belly aches. 
and his flesh is seared just the way I like it. Quiet! <laughs> to win when I transfresh up the teeth. Uh, I'm playing Tekken 7. Nice, Draco. I'm doing okay. How are you? Uh, I'm, I'm a little sick tonight, so I apologize for that, for my voice being all fucked up. But um, Otherwise, we're just going to sit here and play Halo 2 tonight. I'm, I've been sleeping all day, so I'm wide awake. Um, I just don't feel super great. Uh, but I'm down to play at least two more 40, 35, 40 minute episodes if you guys are down. I just got to go check on my, I just go get, get my laundry. So the elite guards, those guys right there that were passing, um, that was our first giveaway we were supposed to do Friday, uh, which was yesterday, uh, June 9th. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to secretly pick the four winners each Friday for the giveaways. And at the end of the, the Halo month, so... Halo month is going to extend into leave, July a little bit. Um, and take your so in July, I will announce the four Release winners the of, uh, of, of our Halo giveaway. And I'm also going to try to grab some swag at E3, the especially Halo e uh, swag, if I can find any, and include it in these giveaways. So um, we're going to extend that, and I'm going to secretly pick the winners um, I am already dead. and then announce them all at once on a on an episode at the end of the month the so, or at the end of the halo of month the Quite so. Here rest the and that way i can just ship them all out at once and and, and get them all done uh, right before i move pass, each one created and consumed in times of extraordinary crisis the taming of the hunters the grunt rebellion were it not for the arbiters the covenant would have broken long ago even on my knees, I do not belong in their presence. Halo's destruction was your error, and you rightly bear the blame. The Council was overzealous. We know you are no heretic. This is the true face of heresy, one who would subvert our faith and incite rebellion against the High Council. Our prophets are false. Open your eyes, my brothers. They will use the faith of our forefathers to bring ruin to us all. The great journey is... Mm. This heretic and those who follow him must be silenced. Their slander offends all who walk the path. What use am I? I can no longer command ships, <coughs> lead troops into battle. Not as you are, no. But become the arbiter. You can just... And you Their aroma of evil just, just pours out of them. They're just like, oh, we're gonna turn you into an arbiter. You're gonna be in the in the hall of greatness, uh, and you got all you gotta do is go kill this other race of this other elite, this other Sangili part of your race, and um, the tasks you must undertake as the arbiter because he's saying that we're liars. You will um, die as each arbiter has before you. The council will have their corpse. So the council, if you remember, was the other prophet, and and then and then the room of full of uh, alien races and stuff. Um, these two prophets are like, oh, we're gonna. They've done this to every arbiter. Arbiter is like a, a, a like a master chief, right? Now, oh, even more than that, it's it's like a title that they're given to their best warriors. At least that's what they're told. But what we're learning is that every arbiter, and what we will learn is that every arbiter has uh, has been a failure. And, uh, and they've been what given a second chance, but it's a suicide mission every time they get sent. So that way there's guaranteed they're gonna die and they die an honorable death. Even though what they're really doing is dying by, with the secrets of the prophets. Um, on the blood of our fathers, so, on yeah. the blood of our sons, we swore to uphold the covenant. Even through our dying breath, those um, who break this oath are heretics. Worthy of neither pity nor mercy. What? What's Even up, Santa Destroyer? We use our Lord's creations to broadcast them live. Um, we shall grind them into dust. What's up, dude? They How's it going? The glorious salvation. Who's, uh, who's whispering that? <laughs> he said, Santa says, whispers, bitch. Who's whispering, bitch? Nothing ever will. You are the arbiter, the will of the prophets. But these are my elites. Their lives matter to me. Yours does not. That makes two of us. Dude, this arbiter is so cool. Santa Destroyer hype! Alright, so after this cutscene, we'll, we'll stop the episode. 
I didn't realize it was going to be this long. Because we're at like a 45 minute episode now. And I'm like, damn, I thought we were going to end at like 40 minutes. That would have been perfect. No, but that's alright. So everyone who's here, uh, don't go away. We will be right back. Uh, just give me a couple minutes to go get my laundry. Uh, old school graphics. We are the arm of the prophets, Arthur. New school graphics. <laughs> Alright. You are the blade, Arbiter. Uh, everyone, thank you so much for being here. We will come back in just about five minutes. If you're here live, you're watching on YouTube later, check out all my links down below and definitely come back for the next episode to find out what happens on Halo 2. 